Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Candy, and today we are going to be doing day number two on skincare. If this is your first time joining me, then welcome, baby. I do different things. Don't be scared of the green hair. I promise you I'm not scary. I mean, I could be, but totally not. But any of my returning fans, thanks so much for coming back, you guys. I appreciate your love and support. It's amazing. So today is going to be day number two on skincare. I recently just got out of the shower. I washed my hair, put a little bit of that conditioner to help with the hair. As you can see, it is starting to fade a little bit and that is okay. Today we are going to be doing a rubber mask. If you guys saw my drugstore haul, you saw that I picked up this mask. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get this mask on, baby. This came from Maskology. This is their intense moisturizing rubber mask mask um side note you hear that that is totally ollie playing around in the living room just screaming out of his butt so sorry if you hear that hashtag sorry not sorry but just letting you know back to this this is a two-stepper says make sure your face is clean check now we're gonna go ahead and put the cream pouch and then massage it onto the skin and then we're gonna open up the rubber mask unfold it uh, adjust it to the openings of the mask lightly press it against the face and then leave it on for 15 to 30 minutes and then it says as soon as you're done with that 15 to 30 minutes just then go ahead to rub it against the face so, um, as you see this is the first top says step one and then this is the mask which would be step two so we're gonna go ahead and take the cream the cream has like this nice like fluorescent scent the sweet almond protein wheat protein soy protein and sodium that's all that's in this cream and there's not a lot of it just a little bit and that's the cream there I'm really excited to do the next video for you guys. It's going to be like DUI on under eye care. My girl Yo-Yo, she's like my sister. She's like my little sister. She's my best friend, Maritza's sister. And she has been asking for an under eye video for so long. And I'm thinking about how her life is. And I really want to incorporate things that you can do at home instead of having to buy like expensive products which there is a lot of things you can use that you can help benefit on getting your under eye done so I'm really excited to do that it's gonna be fun so now that that's done we're gonna go ahead and open the second part which is the mask we're gonna open it. so when you pull it out it's like this and it kind of oh, it's super rubbery <laughs> super rubbery this is gonna be so cool. So I'm just gonna remove the film. So it comes in two pieces. I'm assuming one's for the top, one's for the bottom half of your face. And I'm right, so this one's for the mouth, and this one's for the eyes and nose. Oh, that is super cooling. And it's not like a tacky, sticky, kind of thing like it's nice kind of doesn't help my nose I guess my nose is too wide all right now we're just gonna leave this on for um, 15 to 30 minutes this is gonna be really weird I'm pretty sure I'm gonna scare my children Scared of me right now. 
he does not want to come near me. Like, look. He's like standoffish his arms. Like, I can't even touch him. It's, it's mommy. It's okay. I know it's scary. Yeah, see? I know I scared him. I didn't think I scared him. <laughs> okay, guys. So it has been about 30 minutes. I have like a few minutes left. Um, I kind of just want to give you my little touches before I remove it with you guys and then massage the remaining product in the face. Um, as the 30 minutes have gone by, uh, it has been seriously cooling. It's been really refreshing on my face. It hasn't tightened. It hasn't been itchy. Yeah, it stayed in place except for when I was laughing at my when I scared the boys. It like moved because you know <laughs> it was smiling. But other than that, I put it back like in place, and it's just still been cooling and just chilling there. It literally hasn't moved, which is odd because a lot of these kind of masks move a lot. So I think it's okay for us to go ahead and remove it. My face feels super light. Again, this is supposed to give me moisture. There's not a lot of product remaining, which is nice. Um, it's not like drenching my face down with the product. And it's easy to like massage in as well. So I would say this is like a really good, a really good mask. I mean, I still feel it kind of going right now. And even now I see it being like a little... Like my skin feeling like a little bit more alive even though I just took a shower and I put like moisturizer on like it's still like it looks really pumped right now so I don't have anything wrong to say with the mask so far we'll see how it interacts with my skin later on tonight because the overnight mask didn't do so well on my face the next day I got a lot a lot of bumps so hopefully this is gonna go okay I think it is because it doesn't stay hopefully you guys like and like this enough to want to go try it again I did purchase it at Walmart so your local drugstore um again I will put my haul video up right here so you can check out the remaining items that I did get at the drugstore if you made it this far thanks for hanging out with me if you have any questions on the product let me know I'll let you know again this is your first time stopping by you might as well go and hit that subscribe button and my returning fam i love you guys so much thank you much for coming back again anyway guys thanks so much for hanging out with me and doing a mask and letting me be all girly with y'all today um i'm gonna stop rambling on i will see you guys at the next video bye guys